to achieve our goal of being allowed to religiously revoke, we need to again make sure our court is well, well situated and everybody is happy with everything. So this man, who's not a great spy master, will now be our spy master. And now we hand out a bunch of gifts. Um, let's hand out a bunch of gifts. We'll see. Who is cheap? Can't increase opinion with him. Uh, that's an okay amount of money. How much do you want for a gift? That's a lot. A divisor. Brother, you are so done. Goodbye. Here. You can hate me all. So we have a bunch of me. More or less okay-ish people. But to be quite honest, we don't even need to fill that spot. So let's check again. Who is in favor? Ah, you know what? Is he... Ovanes of Starafan? Is he against or undecided? He's four. So he stays. Who else? Duke Ocean. Count Cameron. Good. Um, sorry, my friend. You be gone. Sorry, my lover. You will also be gone. Where is it? Everyone will kind of dislike that. That's okay. Well, that looks a lot better, doesn't it? Let's have a vote on the whole religious revocation of titles, huh? I must have order. Come on, boys. Oh, wait, does it not work? Do I need to have seats filled? Oh, damn it. Felt a little bit too easy, didn't it? Uh, you might not vote in favor. Okay, we need people with low diplomacy rating right now because they kind of decide on what's going on. So we get him. He's against it. Opinion is less than 59. He is now undecided. Okay, we need to fill our council back up a little bit. Ah, that's not great. Opinion. We go by opinion purely. Our court physician. 10 is not a lot. 10 is not a lot. Oh, we have two undecided and three, four. Yes, and it was approved, which is just lovely, lovely stuff. We have a lot of dangerous factions going on. Oh, no. Dear friend. Okay, he, he's just gonna get... Nope. Nope. No way. He's also going to be... Nope. No way. No way, no how. Not having it. So what's your main title, my dear friend? Duchy of... Yeah. That's gonna be a war, won't it?
But that's okay. That's okay. We will call in our dear friends from across the world. We will fill in our commander slot again with someone who kind of hates us. And is important as well. No one hates us that is important, so we fill it with someone who's uh, more or less okay. And we will raise all our troops instantaneously. Okay, there's a bunch. Okay, we need to be a little bit careful on how we proceed here. Let's build an army group north, which will march straight through here. And an army group center, which will move straight into that. And these guys will also go there. Oh, that's not even their capital. That's their capital. Right. Okay, well done. Oh! What? Nope. 15,000? Just right there? What the hell? Um... Uh, that is very bad for us. It's really very bad for us. I see no way in where that is good for us. Um... Right, my dear Mamluk friends, I call upon you again, once more, to maybe build a little bit of a counterweight. I mean, we get 13,000 from over there, so that's nice. Oh, wait. Ah, there are holy orders for me, Shane. Wait, no, 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 no. You're going the wrong way, brothers. Okay, everyone is attached. Let's have everyone follow us. And we will strike at the heart in Mecca. Well, actually, no. We're gonna fight here and see what happens. A diplomat appears. All right, then. Okay, I'm doing all the weird stuff. None of this makes sense. Bear with me. <laughs> Might make sense at some point. I don't know where he's going. I am not so sure he knows where he's going. Everyone, go take this. Can we afford the Mamluks? Oh, yes, we can. And that just lovely. Okay, we can't siege here because there's enough supply limit. If you look on the little tooltip on the side there, it says supply limit in the middle 19,000. And below that green, the actual number of people that will be there once they arrive. Well, that's a neat way of figuring out if you're doing something sensible or not. And I've sent both the Egyptian and the, I don't know who else that is, armies, to siege Mecca. Sun was born, not to us, though. A 
Mecca is already being besieged by something, which is probably also why he returned his troops. You know what, before you run into your certain death, you go attached to my small army. Don't be weird about it. Do it. Ooh, we can rank up. Very good. Let us rank up indeed. We will train our dear doggy personally, because that's always fun. Come back, my friends. Don't fight the huge army yourself. Now. Vassals. Opinion. Who hates us? Come on now. Don't be shy now. Demonic possession. Tainted touch is also fun, but... We want that. What do we want it with him? Duke of Sirte. Yeah, that's fine. You... You get demonic possession. Let's do it. And your brave, brave troops will join us here somewhere. Someday. As we just continue to siege around here. And we'll have a demonic possession over there. Okay. Um. Nope. God. No. Uh, no. 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 Things just happened. My dear husband died. So now my daughter is the Duchess of a whole bunch of things. Matrilineal marriages only. Please. Why you are no longer betrothed, girl? I gave you a strong nine-year-old boy. This guy. Did I not give you this guy? Come on, be betrothed again. And we will need to find another man as well. What do we need? Really? Diplomacy. Rulership, stewardship. I think we need more stewardship. All oh, this guy's alright. Doesn't like us all that much, but that's fine. We will lose a bunch of prestige over it, but who cares at this point? Alright, he is now a loyal servant. So once we are at peace, we can go around begin demanding some religious conversions here. And since he is a loyal servant, he can also be on the court, on the council. Let's find more Muslim subjects of ours. I think with most of them we're currently at war. This guy doesn't really count because he's going to lose his place again. Alright. We were in an orgy. And we gain lustful. That's okay. Maybe we get pregnant from it, even. What are we to do? Tear down their idols, and that sounds great. We are supposed to take out some temple, which we're totally gonna do. Desecrate the hell out of it. Now we look at our vassals again. And we see... Captain of the Mamluks, come on, man. We have been through so much. Why don't you like us? Why do I have to use the Dark Lord's power to make it here, make it so? All right. As I and a group of my faithful make our way through the church in Lida, I spot a priest tending to their duties in the middle of the night. Right. And we will knock him out. Kill him. Giving us more dark power. And we will possess the captain of the Mamluks. Um, we are being a little bit corrupted at this point. And we are now club-footed, which... Who cares? 
can live with it. And... Yeah, we'll put the relics to our own personal use. And we have succeeded in our little scheme there. Oh no. We destroyed the mind of the captain of the Mamluks, so he's now a lunatic. Didn't work out as planned. But sometimes you just have no control over what a demon you summon from hell does. And we are now possessed as well. That's alright. I mean... Oh no. Pay no attention for a second and you might lose a hell of a lot of stuff. We attack him in the plains. It's not good. We will forgive and forget in hopes of turning this little battle around here. It's not good. We're attacking into the mountains. This is this is gonna be a bad, bad one. Where are the Egyptians? Um... No! Both our armies running into slaughter. Oh no, this is bad. This is quite bad. This is real bad. Let's go give him Tainted Touch. He might die from it. Oh no. Oh no. That was really, really bad. Everything about this was bad. Where are you fleeing to? Why are you not telling me where you're fleeing to? Oh, really? That's a little bit unfair. He's already jumping on my army again. And where are the Egyptians? I swear, what's happening? Where are your troops? Counted on you. Darn it. Yeah, this will be bad. Real bad. Real, real bad. Uh... Yeah, let's capture the heir to the Abiyud Duchy. Who we tried to sway before. Are there any armies I can raise around here? Anything? Anyone? Anywhere? Nothing. Oh god, we will be crushed so hard. There's nothing to be done about it. Are there more mercenaries that I could hire for a reasonable fee? Reasonable, please. The monthly cost is what gets me. These are at a reasonable cost, but they are useless out here. We need something with a lot of horses. Oh god. Where are the Egyptians? I swear. This is deeply annoying. Oh god. Taint a touch. Do your magic, please. Please, please, please. Pretty please. Please taint to touch, kill the dude. Nope, we're losing. Yeah, we're totally losing. Ouch. And... Yeah. He's not even dying from what I did to him. Oh god. And so the dark forces that we summoned 
pretty much turn themselves against us in the worst ways possible. We have almost no troops left and we're being crushed. Crushed, I tell you. They won't accept the white piece. Oh, God. I don't want to surrender to that. How do you have so many troops? Really annoying. And I'm pretty sure he's just going to follow me immediately. No, he's not. He's going somewhere. We have another chance on redemption here. Probably going to try and re-siege this. But he's losing a lot to attrition first. So that's our, our one hope there. Attrition. Where can we do something? Let's get some more... Oh, military organization is not all that great. Let's do this and let's get... I don't know, none of this matters really. Improved keeps. Let's go for castle infrastructure, who cares? And we will actually do... Yeah, we, we, we're gonna employ some more mercenaries here. We need something with a lot of force. A lot of cavalry or pike. Pike would be great. Uh, these are pretty decent. Lots of pike, lots of cavalry. But they're also insanely expensive. We can't keep them for very long. Let's see, how long does this trip take? 17th of April is when it's locked. When will you arrive? Doesn't say. It will be a while. And I still do not see the Egyptians anywhere. But they're our only real hope here. I mean, we don't really need all that many more troops. But we do need a bunch. So let's get one of these. The Alan Raiders. Let's get these. Let's do that. Lots and lots of mercenaries. Who we will send here and then hopefully have a better shot at destroying the enemy. Come on everyone, attach. Oh, he's just crushing it down. Mm, nope, we're gonna wait here. Right here. For the armies to link up. He's going places. And he's instantly sieging stuff down. And he... Nope! He's at 100%. What? No, 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 no. Can he force a piece? I don't know if he can force a piece. Let's fight him. Let's hope we win. Come on, Mamluk captain. You insane, crazy man. Do your thing. One flank broken. One of ours broken. No! No, we have lost. What the hell just happened? I am very confused. Who are you? You are my kinsman. I'm quiet because I'm deeply confused. I figured that if I lost, I would just be kind of kicked out of everything. But apparently not. All right. That's strange. Uh, that's very strange. And our... 
kingdom also is now called Bari. What? Okay, let's give this a quick look here. Queen, is, is she still there somewhere? I mean, she's her mother. Where is she? This was us just now. I don't want to come to court. My dear demonically possessed woman. With all these claims. And so it is we say goodbye to Queen Shaja Aldur. We'll keep an eye on her as we keep forward with the Bari dynasty. Which is alive and well down here, it looks like. This guy's 20 and definitely needs a wife. But he's far away somewhere. He's commander, the prince of Jerusalem. <laughs> uh, we'll have to figure out the pieces next time.